Hello, and welcome to our science web series, brought to you by sciencehook.com. Today, we will understand how data stored in flash drive affects its mass, despite being a closed system. To begin with, we need to know a little about how flash memory works. A flash memory cell is basically a transistor with an electron trap called the floating gate. When the transistor turns on, some of the electrons in the current will tunnel through a thin insulating layer into the floating gate. In the simplest scheme, the presence of these electrons represents a bit set to 1, while their absence represents a bit set to 0. However, this is not always the case, but we will assume this to continue. Now, overall counting of electrons doesn't change in the system. So, where does this extra mass come from? The answer is, due to the energy. Although, the electrons were already present, keeping them still rather than allowing them to float around, takes up extra energy, about 10 to the power minus 15 joules per bit of data. Using Einstein's E equals mc square formula, which states that energy and mass are directly related, it can be calculated that filling a 4 gigabytes drive to its storage limit, would increase its weight by a billionth of a billionth of a gram, or 10 to the power minus 18 gram. This is roughly equivalent to the weight of a small virus. This difference is extremely small, no laboratory equipment can measure it. If it was noticeable, energy of your hard drive would be huge, like a nuclear bomb. Please check the links in the description, for detailed mathematics. So, that's all about concept behind the mass variation in flash drives due to data. Please like and subscribe our channel and don't forget to share this video